Hey New Egorp guys, I'm doing this video just for you. Uh, I've got a multi-touch table project I'm uh, building for somebody I've been contracted to build. Uh, I can't show too much of the final table when it's built, kind of a non-disclosure thing. But anyway, I've uh, I got another piece of acrylic here just like the one I did a few years back. I got a 45 degree uh, bevel on the edge. I took it somewhere and got the thing cut and allegedly polished and it was Horrible. It was terrible. I couldn't believe they gave me back something and called it polished. It was awful. They routered the edge. They left rough marks. Ah. So I took it and ran it through my circular saw by hand with a you know a, a level uh, just clamped onto the thing. And uh, now I'm polishing the edge with a 3M headlight polishing kit that uh, I got from work. I, I'm working now as a BMW Mercedes Porsche mechanic and uh, Mercedes headlight covers, the newer ones have a tendency to get all yellowed out. 3M makes a really cool product. Uh, the kit comes with these pads for Scotch uh, Rolox. Now the light's not too good. I'll have to show you these a little bit closer up over here. Anyway, uh, they're really cool. Let me uh, bring you over here to that bench. Hang on. Here we go. Okay. These are what they look like. They're just little three inch guys. And you start out with a 500 grit. And then you go to an eight. And then there's this, uh, I don't know what it is, like 3000 or something. It's a cloth and it's impregnated with a silicon carbide of some sort. Then there's a neat little polishing pad. And I'm using some uh, plastic polish as the final... Uh, step. So I want to show you just how quickly uh, you can polish the edge of a sheet of acrylic. This is just a cut and then it's sanded if we can get in close enough that you can see. That's just sanded with my random orbital sander 45 degree cut with the uh, table saw. Sanded with my sander 120 grit and it's a little cloudy you can see some little swirl marks in there but that's the starting point. Now remember this was just cut with a, a really fine tooth hollow ground 7 inch circular saw blade on a circular saw. So now real time I'm going to show you just how long it takes to get this thing to a beautiful polished edge. So here we go. First I'm going to clamp the thing in place on the bench here. something on top here to protect it. I don't hurt anything. And I'm going to start out with the 500. So you got to just be careful and stay as 45 degree-ish as you can because it's easy to round it. And uh, the trick is just a couple of quick passes, not too many. Try to stay on the top of the pad so that it's swirling mostly across this way, not the edge. Then you can roll the edge a lot easier. So here we go. You can see the dust coming off as I go along. Just keep a real light touch, use a power drill, and let the uh, sandpaper do the work. After a couple times, you get a feel for it. That's it for the 500. Then we go for the 800 grit. Whoops. That's it. Now we go for that uh, 3000, I think it is. This is the one that makes it look almost clear. You gotta be careful with the uh, 3000. It's a soft pad, you can catch the edge like you saw me do. Okay, that's enough of that. Go to the buffing pad. 
a little bit of this plastic polish on there, not very much at all, just a tiny bit, a couple of dots is all it takes. Kind of rub it in there with your finger a little bit so it doesn't go flying everywhere. With this you want to stay kind of in the middle. Light cut. And there we go. What was that? Maybe uh, two or three minutes tops for one edge. We'll take a look at what we've got here now. Look at that. That's a beautiful thing. That is one very clear edge in no time at all. And as far as the round over goes, it's, uh, it's pretty good. Not rounded over much at all. So uh, try these out. Look for them. Uh, 3M. 3M is awesome. They make some really cool stuff. It's a headlight polishing kit. Get it at most auto parts stores. It comes with some uh, plastic polish other than this. Something made by 3M in a little packet. But uh, really cool. Awesome way to polish the edge of your acrylic super fast. Okay. Nice chatting with you guys. I'll try to keep you posted on this uh, as much as uh, I'm allowed to anyway, and I'll probably be jumping on the forum and asking a few questions because I got to get up to speed on software and uh, cameras and whatnot. I just recently took apart a uh, what is it the uh, PS3i camera. Uh, I've got a um, uh, 940 nanometer uh, filter. I'm going to put in that thing. So I'm thinking of a way I can modify the camera so it'll screw back together a little easier not to deal with that focus problem that I've seen. So anyway, I'll be on the forums. Uh, Tinkerman out.